Redemption! One boy in the hood, north side Indonesian, acts really good, no, not Tunisian. Some bad boys came to cause mischief, came in town with their hair so quick. They acted inappropriate, bad things like expropriate, smoked a lot, hurt their esophagus. At first we thought they were icky diophagus. They were into peer pressure. All they cared about was, who's looking fresher? Dude was nice, lived in town his whole life. In school he was prime studying stuff all the time. Always spectacular practice in a vernacular. Boy had an A average, smarter than the others. That's vassalage. Never rebellious, read lots of Athanasius. That's right, he pours tea Resist for his mum. That's right, he gives quarters to no bums. Privation. That's right, he pours tea Resist for his mum. That's right, he gives quarters to no bums. Privation. The bad boys became persuasive. The bad boys were abrasive. Come on, man, it'll be extravagant. Don't mind our assonance. So the good boy became substandard. He went outside of his gerrymander. He came close to a terrible addiction. Could have resulted in bronchoconstriction. Little brownie. Now the Bahasa knew it was in a posit, but he had as much power as a euro deposit. He worked hard on his recuperation, getting off of drugs, laxation. The Malay picked up his standing position, got back into onomastician. The bad boys got malignant, but the good one was indignant. That's right, he pours tea for Resist his mom. The temptation. That's right, he gives quarters oh, to his yeah, no privation. That's right, he pours tea for Resist his mom. That's right, he gives quarters oh, yeah, to his no bones. privation. The good boy was now rectified, stopped doing drugs like the lopramide, got good grades, less companions, getting those A's like a champion. He's now a good, gentle person, no longer doing hydromorphine. His parents are now glorious that he's mastered the Stradivarius. Lil Brownie. Now those bad kids are in juvenile despair, not too long before they get the chair. That's what happens when you leave education, they'll never learn about polyesterification. <laughs>